What's up guys and welcome back to another crap strategy video. Today I'm going to show you guys the most popular crap strategy video on YouTube. Now, it doesn't have a name for it, but if you just type in uh, most famous crap strategy video or something along those lines, it's going to pop up. Uh, there's two guys that I know that do it. I have the most views on YouTube. I don't know what their name is. Our names are, but shout out to you guys for putting it on there. Uh, I'm going to roll it out for you guys, and uh, we'll see uh, how it works. Now, again, uh, we're not doing a roll for like 30 minutes or anything like that, but we'll we'll do a few rolls, a few shooters, and see how it goes. Uh, but uh, I do recommend, if you are playing at a $10 table, that you have at least a $500 bankroll. Um, you know, you would want to have at, you know at least enough for 10 shooters. You can do the math on that yourself. Uh, but we'll go ahead and dive into the strategy. Um, so what you are going to do is you're going to start off with a pass line of ten dollars, uh, and then you're going to wait for your point. So you'll get some dice, and here we go. That is a nine six three nine center field. Point's going to be nine. Okay. Now at this point, what you're going to do is you're going to Put seventy-five dollars on the in the DC, and you can hedge this a little bit. You can, you know, put a five-dollar yo uh, on there, and that would uh, cover that. Uh, but this right here, this is where it's going to hit hard if we do point if we do point seven out. Uh, it is an eighty-five dollar loss, but hopefully we can get past it. I'm not going to play the yo. We're just going to ride out and hope for the best, and we're going to. See where the DC travels. And it's a nine. That's a frontline winner. So we're going to get paid here on our pass line. Puck's going to come off, and the DC is going to travel behind the nine. We'll wrap that up. And we're going to wait for a new point. Five. Fever Field, no five. Point's going to be five. All right, now here's what we're going to do. We are going to go across the board. We're going to go ten dollars on the four, twelve dollars on the six and eight, and ten dollars on the ten. Ten dollars coming. Get some change here. Cap these off, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go three times in odds on your pass line. So that'll be thirty dollars. So right now. If a seven comes, we're gonna lose our pass line, the four, six, eight, and ten, but we're gonna win the come bet, and we're gonna win our DC bet of seventy-five dollars. And we'll I'll explain as we go of what, we're, of what we're gonna do once the come bets start going. Ooh, nine center field nine. So that's not good for our DC. We're gonna lose that come bet's gonna travel to the nine. And now what we're going to do is we are going to go seventy-five dollars back in the DC, but we're going to tell we're going to tell the dealer to turn our bets off, and we're going to take down our odds. Now our come bet is automatically working; we can't turn that off, and we don't have odds on it yet, so it doesn't matter about those. Uh, so the only thing we have at risk here is if we seven out right now, we're going to lose the DC and the pass line and the come bet. We're just trying to get this DC back in action. Here we go. Ooh, three, three crap. So that's a quick win for us in the on the DC. So that's good. Kind of got that back. Now we're looking for a new home for this DC. Eight, eight, easy, six, two, eight. Not really the most ideal spot, but it is what it is. All right. So now we got a home for our DC. We're gonna. Take our odds for our pass line, put it back. And what we're going to do is we're going to take down the place bet eight. We'll take $10 of that, put it in the come. And now, what we're going to do for our odds on our come bet. Uh, in the video that they do, um, you know, they, they do two times odds and then they level up. I'm going to make it a little bit more simple for our conservative listeners out there. We're just going to start off with single odds. On our come bets, and as we as we hit them, we will work our way up. We'll, once we hit the single odds, then we'll go to two times odds, three times odds, and we'll stop at three times odds. All right, everything's set, ready to go. 
five. Feeder field, no five, and that is a point hit. So the combat's gonna travel to the five. Puck's gonna come off, and we're gonna get paid here. Pass line. Paid 10 for our flat. I believe we're gonna get paid 45. My math is right, yep, 45. So let's get some, let's do this. We'll drop $5 to the dealer and we'll pay ourselves 50. Makes it a little bit easier. Okay, a little bit of a win there. Okay, and now our place bets are automatically off, obviously. Our come bets are working. Uh, now um, our, uh, Odds on our come bet, we want those off, so make sure you tell the, tell the dealer to turn my odds off on the come bet. Sometimes they're automatically off, other places they're not. Uh, so here we go. Five, back on that five. Three, two, five. So that five on the come bet's gonna get paid quickly. And we're gonna go back in the come for $10. And then we're gonna go three times and off again on our fast line. We're all set up and ready to go. 10, 10, hard 10. This come bet's gonna travel here. And we'll drop the dealer $2 and get paid 20 for our $10 place bet. Now what we're gonna do here is so we have, oh, I meant that, that meant to go inside. So now what we're gonna do here is we don't wanna double dip, so we're gonna take down our place bet of our 10, put single odds in the 10. We'll put $10 back in the come. And then we have $10 we're gonna rack up. We always want a come bet in action. We, all, we always want that going on. All right, here we go. Eight, eight the easy way, five, three, eight. It's not good for our DC, we're gonna lose there. Come bet's gonna travel to the eight. And we're gonna take down our uh, Pass line odds, and we're gonna ask the dealer to turn off our bets, even our odds on our come bets. We're gonna go $75 back in the DC. Here we go. Seven, seven out. Ooh, that's that's where it bites you. That's where it's gonna hit you. So that's a seven out, but we did have our odds off. We had our place bets off. So and so the only thing we lost, we lost our pass line. We lost our come bets, our flat bets. We we'll lose those. We did manage to keep our twenty dollars in odds total and our place bet, but we did lose our seventy-five dollars DC. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go back on the pass line and start all over. Here we go. Number a point five. Fever field no five. We're gonna ask the dealer, please keep these bets off. We're gonna go $75 back in the DC. Trying to find a new home for that. Here we go. Six, six the hard way. So the DC is gonna travel to the six. Let's get this down. And we'll go $10 in the come. $30 in odds. Get everything going here. Cap this eight off, and we're all set and ready to go. All right, here we go, the dice are moving. Seven, seven out, that was quick. All right, so we are gonna lose our pass line, we're gonna lose our four, we're gonna lose the eight, nine, and 10. We are gonna win the come, we're gonna win $75 here. Let's pay ourselves some green. That up back on the pass line. You can kind of get a gist of how the strategy works. It's fun, but it can bite you in the butt. All right, here we go. Looking for a new point. Four for the easy way. Three, one, four. And seventy-five dollars back in the DC. And this is where we do not want to see. You know what? Four, frontline winner four. That's good for the DC too. We're gonna get paid here for our pass line. Rack that up. 
DC is going to travel behind the four. And now we are looking for a new point. Wouldn't mind seeing a seven right now. Seven, 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 seven. Nope, eight. Easy eight. Six, two, eight. And now let's get everything set up again. We'll go $30 in odds on the pass line. $10 coming. Ten and five. 12 on the 6, 10 on the 9, 10 on the 10, and need some more change. Looks good. And we are ready to rock. Here we go. 9, meaner 9, center field 9. 9 is going to travel, or comes going to travel to the 9. We're going to get paid. We'll drop a dollar to the dealer and get paid 15 for one. Okay. So $10 in odds, $10 in the come, rack up five. And here we go. Let's see that nine again. Five, fever field, no five, three, two, five. Okay, so comes going to travel to the five. $10 five is going to get paid 15 for one. That up, so ten dollars in odds. Rack up five. All right, let's try to hit that five or nine. Five or nine. How about an eight? Eight the easy way. Front line winner eight. So comes gonna travel to the eight. Puck's gonna come up. We're gonna get paid here. Let's see here. Ten dollars for a flat bet, and thirty six for our odds. I think that's right. That's 25, 30, 35, 36. Perfect. That's not always my strong suit. Never really has been, but you know, that's why I have this chart back here. Okay, now we're looking for a new point. We want our odds to be off. I mean, you can keep them on if you want to. I, I keep mine off. Nine, meter nine, center field nine. I guess I should have had them on. My odds were off, so I'm going to take this, put it back in my rack, but I ain't going to get paid for the flat bet. Perfect. Go back in the come. Three times in odds. Let's get single odds on the eight. And we're good. All right, here we go. Eight. Eight the easy way. Five, three, eight. All right. I'm going to get paid $10 for a flat. $12 for odds. We're going to go off and on right here. So we're just going to rack up all this. And let's go ahead and go up the second level. So at $20 in odds. Here we go. Four. Ooh, hard four. That's not the number we wanted to see, but it happened. So we're going to lose that. Comes going to travel to the four, and we're going to ask the dealer to turn off our bets, take down our pass line odds, and our odds. We want our odds and our come bets to be off as well. So the only thing we have working on are, are the original come bets and pass line. Here we go. Six, six, the easy way. Four, two, six. Oh, I messed up. I meant to have seventy-five dollars in here. When I rolled that, so that was a six, so that will travel behind the six. We're going to take our place bet down on the six, ten dollars in the cup. We'll turn our bets back on. Let's get our single odds on that four, and everything looks good. Yep, everything looks good to go. How about that eight? Let's see that eight again. Four, three, one, four. Not bad. We're going to go on and off on these. We are going to get paid 10 for the flat and 20 for our odds. We're going to go up the second level, rack this up, and then we are good to go. How about four or eight? Four or eight. 10, 10 the easy way. Six, four, 10. Okay, come back's going to travel to the 10. We're going to get paid, we'll do a two, drop the deal of $2 and get paid 20. We're going to go $10 in odds, 
ten dollars back in the comb and rack up ten. And here we go. Three, three traps. That's a loser in the comb. So ten back in the comb. Here we go. Eight, eight the easy way. Five, three, eight. Good for us. So twenty dollars in odds on the eight. It's gonna be twenty-four dollars. So ten dollars for the flat. We'll drop the deal one dollar and get ice cream chip. And we'll go up one more level. We'll just do this. Place that thirty. All right. Here we go. Are moving. Seven, seven out. Six, one, seven. All right, so we're going to lose our pass line. We're going to lose these. We're going to lose this. We're going to get paid ten dollars in the comb and seventy-five dollars right there. Okay, it's a lot of, on the strategy, so I'm going to stop the video right here. Um, Looks like we lost a little bit too. So we started with 500. That's 100. That's 100. And there's four. We won't count that though. We're going to tip that to the dealer. Thanks for dealing for us. So 100, 200, 3, 4, 50. So we lost $50. It's a fun strategy. You know, it's very intriguing to me. I like it, but I don't know. If I would play it at a casino, just because I'm not bringing huge amounts of uh, money to a casino, I'm just going there trying to last as long as I can to have a good time. Uh, but it is there's is a very fun strategy to do here at home. Uh, but let me know what you guys think. Uh, drop a comment in the in the comments uh, and just let me know. Uh, and again, thanks again for watching, guys. Until next time, we'll see you later.